When I looked out the window, it wasn't people, it was a bear, a big black bear. I camped uh, one evening at a place called Selwyn Station um, and I fell asleep, I fell asleep really, really quickly. And I didn't wake up until I know exactly what time it was, it was 6.30 a.m. So I heard a loud thud and I felt something heavy on my, sh on my shoulder. It was my wor worst nightmare and the bear was right there in front of me. I play a thing called a tin whistle, okay, not very well, just kind of blew into it as, as unmelodiously as I can. It really seemed to piss off the bear. It was growling and snarling and twitching its ears. And I'd read that that was, that was a sign that this, this was a proper attack. I deployed the bear spray. I was deploying it through the mesh of the tent. The bear recoiled um, and I got a whack of the bear spray in my face, a lot of it. And I fainted almost immediately. The good news is that when I woke up, the bear wasn't there. So I got out of there really quickly. So he is good natured about it. He survived, I think, unscathed. And so we can kind of look at it and have fun with the fact that he kind of fainted or, you know, kind of accidentally sprayed himself as well. But can you imagine how terrifying all that was? And they don't hand out medals for, you know, surviving those kinds of things in the great outdoors, but they ought to, and he should get one.